Who surprised you the most, do you think, Dylan, as a player or someone maybe we've seen come back from college or we haven't seen for a while make the way back out onto court? Any, anyone really caught your eye? Um, I really like uh, this Kenneth Tuffin. Um, I didn't know anything about him coming into this tournament. Um, also Mulvahu, I was, I've been impressed with what he's done. Um, but with the youth... Kamusta mga bro? Welcome ka rito. Maraming salamat sa pag-like at sa pag-subscribe sa Basketball PH Review. Nagtala si Ken Tuffin ng 19 points at 3 rebounds para pangunahan ang Taranaki Airs sa kanilang ikaapat na laro. At ang maganda sa laro na ito ay naging efektibo ang outside shooting ni Kenneth Tuffin. Nakapagtala siya ng 83% beyond the arc o 5 out of 6 sa 3-point line. Huskies, here we see the nice drive by Francis Mulvihill and Leon Henry. Jones, calling for a screen from Stanton Pro. It comes, finds Tuffin who catches a shoot from the corner and Kenneth Tuffin gets it to go. His own rebound and pulling it up in the air. Who's going to go get that? Tuffin. Oh, Tuffin goes up and hits well. the ground hard. But his team will have the ball through Daron Morocco. He goes to work on Tane Murray. There's Tuffin the other end of it, and down it goes. And Kenneth Tuffin, he did it the hard way, but he earned all three of those points. He read nicely, he did that well. He did read it well, got a hand right up in and Marcel Jones' shot. And that's a sign of, of doing a good scout. Marcel Jones' last game, he hit that shot two or three. Tuffin had 14. There's last run out against the Rams. One of my favorite things about the NBL tournament this year is the number of talent that it's unearthed that every wasn't necessarily a household name here in New Zealand, even for basketball circles, which is pretty tight, but a lot of young men getting the opportunity to show that they're capable of contributing at a much higher level than was previously thought. Kenneth Tuffin is certainly on that list for me. Absolutely, as Haku draws a foul, go the line. Kenneth Tuffin went to St. Pat Silverstream, jetting off to the Philippines. Four years of college. Second differential is Orokawa. Finds Mulverhill, shoots the three from the wing, and down it goes. Francis Mulverhill had the last say of the first quarter. Finish like Toy Smith Milner. Mulverhill. Timida for three. Over Smith Milner. That goes in and out. Tuffin with a rebound. Tuffin, what a heck of a quarter in the first. Ten points. Getting some offensive rebounds too. Here comes the upper the other way. Most potential of all the players in terms of the New Zealand NBL. In NBL showdown for 2020. As Kenneth Tuffin adds to his points total. 13 for him now. Murray. The upper. Shoots over Tuffin. And that one's short. That's a very good point. Marcel Jones. I guarantee yeah. my parents would not have let me go at 16. Tuffin did right. Little floater from Kenneth Tuffin. Too much on it. Works hard to get his own rebound. That's Marcel Jones. Shoot for three. That's a go either Marcel Jones. Has it been his? With Kenneth Tuffin now, who shot the ball really well to start. 13 points in the first half, but but things weren't going quite as well as you guys would like defensively. Yeah, it's just defensive transition. I think you know Zaya and Taylor playing really well at the moment, and of course Leon's always shooting the ball really well. We just have to focus on that, and we'll look at the stats, and we'll, we'll come back. Sakakawa and Jones. What about Kenneth Tuffin? 13 points for him in the first half. Slowed down a little bit in the second quarter, 10 points at the quarter time, but his shooting has been really pivotal for keeping the Taranaki Mountaineers even as close as they are. I appreciate his toughness too. He does a lot of this. Uh, at what point, at any point in the fourth quarter with a game that may be out of hand, are you going to pull this back and give your starters a bit of a rest? Oh, there's always an opportunity to win. There we go. There we go. I like it. Glad to hear it. Thanks, Coach. Appreciate your time. Thank you. So you in on the rest of that Kurt Pity story next time. <laughs> He's waiting with bated breath. Marvin Williams down drives at high Winyard, and that's a foul. So I'm at breakers practice, KC. Back into it. For the Kurt Petty rookie card that I found on eBay. And 2018. What's, what's going to happen when he matures? <laughs> I'm definitely double checking it though. Oh, it's Kenneth Tuffin. He's been a shining light for the Mountaineers today. And he drains another three. And I'm here with Kenneth Tuffin, who had uh, 19 points in the game. A difficult game for you guys. What can you build on from this one? I think we just uh, started slow defensively. We dug, a, dug ourselves a hole in the start. So I think we have to come up with more energy. Uh, starting from the start, starting from me, everyone else in the starting group. I think it starts with us, and we'll be okay from there.
And how was it defending or going up against that zone defense? It saw a lot of that, particularly in the first half. Did that zone kind of stem your guys' aggression? Previously, you've been driving to the rim a lot. Today, it seemed like you settled for a lot of threes. I mean, in the previous game, they haven't, been really, they haven't really been running the zone, so we didn't really pay much attention to it. So I think it's just little things like that we need to look at, you know, all around how we're looking to score. And if they throw anything at us, we have to be ready. And two and two now, of course, you're going to be bouncing back. What, where, where do you think you most need to improve on, on this performance and possibly on the, the first week as well? You know, what, where's the, the weakness right now? And if you can get that fixed, you guys can get things going well. I think it's just uh, decent, de defensively, uh, controlling the energy, controlling the tempo. And uh, as I said, it starts with us, uh, the starting group and, and the, the veterans of the team. Well, energy and tempo is something you've been fantastic at so far. I look forward to seeing more of it. Thank you very much. 23-year-old Kenneth Tuffin counting himself as a veteran of the team. That's great to hear. And Certainly led the way for the Mountaineers in a losing effort tonight. 19 points and an efficient 19 points at that. Six to nine from the field and 24 minutes of action for Tuffin to go with three rebounds. Or finally out of the game. It's been one of the real finds as Dylan Boucher mentioned when he joined us in commentary. Not a guy a lot of people knew about having spent the last four years on scholarship in the Philippines. But a guy certainly we know about now and can't wait to watch for the next five weeks.